We introduce the first neural network to learn structure from motion estimation on event-based data. Using as input the event stream from a DVS, we estimate the sensor's 3D motion, flow, and depth, as shown in this driving scene from the MVSEC dataset. Input to our neural network are the events within a small time interval, which we call event slices, and which are represented as three 2D arrays. These arrays encode the number of positive events, the number of negative events, and the average timestamp at each point. The architecture consists of an encoder-decoder network estimating scale depth from a single event slice and a second encoder network estimating pose from consecutive event slices. These networks are trained in a self-supervised way by estimating optical flow with efficient matrix multiplications to warp neighboring arrays to the middle array. The novelty of the approach lies in our network architecture the evenly cascaded encoder network. In addition to increasingly complex features, it uses low-level features at different scales in all its layers. For depth prediction, higher-level features are gradually merged into lower-level ones, and the encoding layers are merged into the decoding layers via skip links. Predictions are made at multiple resolutions. First, we predict at the coarse level with multi-level features. Then, the estimations are upsampled and refined in deeper decoding layers by estimating the residues from the coarse prediction. Results are shown for three sequences, a day driving sequence, a night driving sequence, and an indoor drone flying sequence. We show the DVS output, ground truth optical flow, the network output for flow, ground truth depth, and the network output for depth. ECN's flow estimation outperforms the state-of-the-art and has advantages over the current dominant architecture. ECN's depth estimation is comparable to state-of-the-art methods using standard video input, but on sparse data and training on a much smaller data set. We integrate the predicted velocities to reconstruct the full car trajectory and demonstrate our results on one of the sequences. We observe a relatively small drift between the estimated trajectory, in red, and the ground truth, in black. The network performance is shown on additional videos. Note the good reconstruction on the night sequences. Even when, due to LiDAR limitations, the ground truth depth is missing, the network can reconstruct the depth.